Hi everyone. In this video, we're going to study definition and types of improper integrals. By definition, improper integrals are integrals with infinite limits of integration. We have here examples. Number one, the integral from one to positive infinity, dx over x raised to 3 over 2. Second example, the integral from negative infinity to 0 of the function e raised to 3x dx. Third example, the integral from negative infinity to positive infinity of the function 1 all over 1 plus x squared dx. Let us see now types of improper integrals. We have type 1 when the domain of integration is infinite. Category 1 if f of x is continuous on the interval from a to positive infinity. Then the integral from a to positive infinity of f of x dx equals the limit of the integral from a to b of f of x dx as b approaches infinity. Category 2. If f of x is continuous on the interval from negative infinity to b, then the integral from negative infinity to b of f of x dx equals the limit of the integral from a to b f of x dx as a approaches negative infinity. Category 3, if f of x is continuous on the interval from negative infinity to positive infinity, then the integral from negative infinity to positive infinity of f of x dx equals the integral from negative infinity to c f of x dx plus the integral from c to positive infinity f of x dx where c here is any real number. Take note, in categories 1 and 2, the improper integral converges if the limit is finite and the limit is the value of the improper integral. If the limit fails to exist, the improper integral diverges. For category number 3, the integral on the left-hand side of the equation converges if both improper integrals on the right-hand side converge. Otherwise, it diverges and has no value. Let's have type 2. This time, when the range of integrand is infinite. Category 1, if f of x is not defined at x equals a and is continuous on the interval a b, then the integral from a to b of f of x dx equals the limit of the integral from c to b f of x dx as c approaches a from the right. Category 2. If f of x is not defined at x equals b and is continuous on the interval a b, then the integral from a to b of f of x dx equals the limit of the integral from a to c f of x dx 
as C approaches B from the left. We shall have sample problems of solving improper integrals on the next video. I hope you learned something from this video. See you again next time. Thank you.